Atlas. Here's another one. Ah. Persona 4, dancing all night. Yeah, that'll do it. A pause right there. potential in you. You are totally on fire right now. I'm starting to look forward to the show. But I still can't help but be nervous. I hope people come to see us. I'd expect quite a crowd. How are the numbers looking, Minoru? It's a sold out show, fortunately. Almost every seat in the stadium's main stage should be packed. The size of the audience will dwarf any of Kanamine Kitchen's previous performances. A full stadium? Oh man, oh man. <laughs> Just imagine that. All those people waiting to see you two. You'll really show the crowd what a bond looks like. You'll become one with the audience. And your performance will be legendary in the idol world. We're going to be legends? Wow. <laughs> that would be something to see. It's very difficult to put on such a show that you truly become one with the audience to convey how you feel through song and dance and having people understand you. That's no mean feat. It isn't easy. Minoru, honey, will you stop throwing a wet blanket over us when we're trying to get hyped up here? I'm sure these girls can do it. I taught them everything they know, after all. Oh, sorry about that. But since Nanako-chan is performing too, I thought raising the bar too high might make her nervous. Hmm. This is why you suits always get in our way. You don't have any vision. That's right. It's not easy. Even Yuko-san. Huh? Huh? What did I just... Ah! Big sis? Konami, are you all right? Konami-chan. Come on, snap out of it. Are you okay? Don't shake her. Lay her on her back. Because it wouldn't reach anyone. Or they wouldn't understand if it did. No matter how much she wanted to express herself. 
That's why you go, son. Oh, yeah, I... Are you awake, big sis? Oh, Nanaka-san. I'm sorry. I guess I collapsed. You passed out during practice, so we had you transported back home. No, there's no need to get up. We had a doctor look at you. The good news is he says it's probably just exhaustion. This is so embarrassing. Well, you have been working non-stop lately. You should at least take today off and recover. <laughs> That's so nice of you. Oh, also, I got approval from the executives about the situation with the other girls. I'll go talk to the police tomorrow. For real? I'm surprised they didn't put up more of a fuss. It wasn't easy, mind you. Yukun and his friends are involved too, so I used that and what Dojima-san told me to bolster the case. I've been in this industry for quite some time, you know. I like to think I know a trick or two to fight my battles by now. Yikes! Inoue-san, uh... Still, since that's in motion, there's nothing we can do about their part in the festival anymore. It wouldn't be right to keep their names on the program when we have a formal search for them underway. They won't be able to appear at LMB, huh? I know how much they were putting on the line for this festival, too. That's why I tried to hold out so long, to avoid this at all costs. In no way, son. But don't let it bother you. I realized something from what you said to me, Konami-chan. Even if it turned out to be nothing serious and those girls ended up resenting me, I should have prioritized their safety to begin with. Oh, that guilt is like a knife to the gut. <laughs> Stop that. I just told you that this was my fault. Well then, I'd better get going. I need to get up early tomorrow, so I'm gonna have Nanako-chan stay with one of the agency ladies. Your job for tonight is to get plenty of rest and be back to your chipper self when I come to get you tomorrow morning. Oh, thank you. Sis, will you be okay by yourself? Oh, Nanako-san. I'll be okay. I'm a grown woman compared to you. <laughs> Aw, that's no fair. I'm a big girl, too. That's true. You really have kept me going, Nanako-san. So, will you dance with me again tomorrow? Mm-hmm. I'll dance with you. Alrighty, then you're on. I just have to get better by tomorrow. You just have to. <laughs> <laughs> See you tomorrow, Nanako-san. Bye-bye, big sis. Again. This room feels so much bigger now. I wonder if it's because Nanako-san's been staying over with me. Huh? My diary? When did I take that out? Oh, this isn't good. My sleepiness is coming back with a vengeance. I just have to sleep for now. Forget everything and stay as the you everyone wants to see. Then you can remain happy. 
It's for your own good. Something smells good. Oh, you're up! How are you feeling? Are you fevery? Well, I'm seeing a vision of Nanako-san. Am I still dreaming? <laughs> But you're awake! I'm here right now! Huh? Huh? Nanako-san! I thought you left with Inoue-san! That was yesterday, though. Is it... the next day already? Yeah, must be. Huh. But Nanako-san, how did you get here? You weren't picking up the phone, so I came here with Inoue-san. He said you should eat that. Oh, your tummy grumbled. It's saying that it's hungry. That's so thoughtful. I slept without eating anything last night, so my stomach is raging at me. Anyway, I just have to eat. <coughs> oh, uh, sorry to dig in alone like this. Have you eaten, Nanako-san? Yeah, the agency lady made me breakfast. No, that's, that's good. No, wait, so where's Inoue-san? He unlocked the front door and then said he'd be at the car. He said, come down when you're ready to go. Yikes, then I'd better hurry. I just have to wolf this down and get going. I am no... Huh? Who's calling me now of all times? Hello? It's me. Dojima-san! Ah! What's got you so worked up? Do you have something to be ashamed of? No, of course not! I'm with Nanako-san right now, so... Oh, that's right. Sorry, but can you tell Nanako to step away for a moment? It's probably hard for you to say what you need to when she's around. Give me one second. Nanako-san? Um... It's Dad, right? I'll go down to the car. Huh? But don't you feel lonely? Dad's always like that. It's okay, Big Sis. I know my dad loves me. I... okay. I'll be waiting at the car. Master, you there? Oh, yes. Sorry. So, what about Nanako? Um, she said she'd wait at the car. She volunteered herself. Ah, well, don't worry about her. She'll be fine. But, but... It's all right. She's my family. I love her, and she knows it. It may not look like it sometimes, but we do share a strong bond. You love her, and she knows it. Ugh! Master, what's wrong? Oh, uh, I'm fine. So, how can I help you? I'm actually in a little bit of a hurry. All right, I'll make this quick. Those mass lethargy syndrome patients seem to have started recovering. Really? There are still more patients coming in, but a number of them are waking up now. This just happened yesterday and today, but I'm told that some have already been released from the hospital. So, what will you do now, Dojima-san? I plan on going to talk to them this afternoon. Maybe one of them can tell me something. Okay. I'll be with Nanako-san at the festival today, but I'll contact you as soon as it's over. I'll let you know if I find anything out. Tell Nanako good luck for me. 
Same goes to you too. Thanks. I'll make sure to tell her. Thanks. See ya. Huh. So that's what bombs are like. All right, hey, I need you to frame that know this up. Goes? Lighting's bad here. Okay, no, then, okay. let's move on. Yeah, Next up is the part with yep. Kaname right. Kitchen. Uh, Can you handle this? Mashita san, Dojima-san, Yura. No, what are you doing? To the left. Hey, if you don't care about this, then go home, you moron. You can't do it, then pull back a little bit, all right? Okay, I understand. I'm sorry. Can you help me get a place for this? And then, Thank you for everything. Don't you even do it. Okay, I'll figure something out. Rosie, daylight hair, paintball. I don't even know what this is. Oh, that might probably work. Oh, you got it. Not that way. This is really cool. I've never been involved with this. Great. We'll have you two come in side by side, just like that, and stop on this mark. After that, the MC will make his entrance. Let's see, as for the reason why Konami Kitchen and Kujikawa-san are off the roster? I'm supposed to give some pretext to not reveal the actual reason? Got it. I wasn't going to go off script anyway. We have a specific block for you to fill, so don't leave the stage even after the song is done. When the MC comes in and takes over, we'll give the sign then for you to go off stage. It seems there's one more witness in that case who hasn't come forward yet. A witness? Sis? Ah, I'm here! The man said we should stay on the stage even after we finish dancing. Oh, right. Got it. And that'll be it for Konamine Kitchen's part. The first half of the show ends there. There'll be a ten-minute intermission while the broadcast ads play. Anyone whose spot is over should be on standby in the dressing room. All right, okay. thanks everyone. Oh, that is nice. all for yeah, now. Good. Good. Okay, yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thanks. Great job. Good 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 but the steps won't change. Just dance as if the others were all here. How about it? You think you can do this? Uh, I'll be okay. I can handle it. Oh, good. I'll be counting on you. You still have some time, so why don't we all go back to the dressing room? Love Meets Bonds is about to start. Tomamine, Tomamine, Sumamine, Nozamine, even Risa-senpai and her friends haven't come back yet. I'm going to have to sing a song about Bonds all by myself. <laughs> huh? Did I hear something? Big sis? What's wrong? Oh, uh, be right there. Inoue-san's asleep. Do you think he's okay? It's fine. He's been busy too, so I'm sure he's just tired. <sighs> Whoops. <laughs> Shame on me, huh? Sorry, I've been working several nights straight. Nuh-uh. It's okay. Dad falls asleep on the sofa all the time. Dojima-san too? 
<laughs> he does seem like a busy man. By the way, looks like the public responded well to your appearance in that publicity shoot. Some people are even calling it a duet between a goddess and an angel. <laughs> Sounds about right. I wouldn't call myself a goddess, but Nanoko-san is definitely cute. I'm cute? <laughs> I think you're cute too, Big Sis. Uh, I don't know about that. Honestly, I've got no confidence in myself anymore. <laughs> Mind you, there'll always be people to complain about Kanamine Kitchen's set getting cancelled, or about Risei-chan. But don't let the haters get to you. Just let yourself go and show the crowd who you truly are, and I'm sure everyone will understand. Who I truly am. Oh, sorry, I have to step out for a moment. Without Mizo Chimizu around, all the paperwork has been directed my way. Konami-chan, Nanako-chan, you two should stay on standby here. Huh? Oh, crud, I've completely forgotten. Now, what was the pin Mizo Chimizu used again? 1324. Huh? Mizo Chimizu's number, right? It's 1324. I'd never forget that, because there's a meaning behind it. You're right, it's 1324, but how did you know, Konami-chan? I heard that Mizo Chimizu decided on that passcode privately with a girl she used to manage. Huh? I... how did I just... Sorry, sorry, I shouldn't have spooked you like that before your performance. I probably told you about it sometime, or maybe you heard it from Mizo Chimizu herself. In any case, thank you. I'll be on my way. Hey, Big Sis? The numbers just popped into my head. Why? Oh, your bag fell over. Sorry, Nanoko-san. No, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have tried to touch your stuff. Oh, that's not it. I just... It wasn't your fault at all, Nanoko-san. That's okay. I'm sorry, Big Sis. Oh, jeez. What am I doing? <sighs> okay, let's take a break. I brought playing cards. Let's go over there and play Old Maid. Old Maid? Okay. It's all right. She's my family. I love her, and she knows it. It may not look like it sometimes, but we do share a strong bond. To convey how you feel through song and dance and having people understand you. That's no mean feat. Bonds aren't easy. Hello again, you two. I've taken care of my business. Looks like all that's left is to wait for your turn on stage. Welcome back, Inoue-san. 
You don't look so well, Kanami-chan. Are you okay? Uh, I'm all right. It's not like I'm sick or anything. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Dojima-san called earlier. He did? I guess his call didn't get through to your cell phone. He seemed like he wanted to talk to you if you had time, so I told him that you'd be able to after your performance. Either way, we'll be going to the police about the missing girls once this is over. Oh, that's right. I'm sorry. Uh, one moment, please. Mashita-san, Dojima-san, it's time. Please be on... St oh, right! Well then, have fun, you two. Go get them! I gotta clear my head for now. The audience is waiting. Everyone is here to see us. I'm not alone. This is the Love Meets Bonds Fest. So I gotta do whatever I can to show my bond to them. All right! Nanako-san, it's time for us to ride into battle! Mm-hmm! Let's ride! Huh? What's wrong, big sis? I thought I heard something. Konami-chan, are you sure you're okay? You're not feeling ill again, are you? Oh, not at all. It's nothing. I'm fine. All right. Time to go, then. Don't get too nervous out there. Will do! are heating up! Is everyone about ready to jump around and make some noise? All right then, why don't we dive right into our star performance? Whoa, sounds like you're into that idea. Then should I call them out right now? Presenting our special one night only duo, here comes Kana Coco! Here they are, our lovely ladies. Oh, I get it. Your duo's called Kanakoko because you're Kanamine and Nanako. Yep, that's exactly it. But isn't there an extra ko in there? What's with that? Um, the last ko is from my name. Of course. That's exactly what I was thinking just now. So now I want to ask what the co in the middle is for, but Nana Chan's so cute that I just don't care. <laughs> Let's see, between the two of you, you average out to be 11 and a half years old? So young, that's less than a third of my age. <laughs> that's because of Nanako-san here. It's kind of cheating in a way. I'm cheating? <laughs> of course you are. Don't worry, Nana-chan. Everything's A-OK -okay with you. So, tell us, Nana-chan, did you get any sleep last night? Mm-hmm. Dad wasn't there snoring in the next room, so I slept great. <laughs> Man, your poor dad probably worked so hard. Try not to bag on him too much, okay? So, do you still need your dad to take you to the bathroom at night? <laughs> into some thorny territory, so I'll stop right there. <laughs> now, let's hear from you, Kanamine. Good evening. Can I just say how shocked I was when I heard that Kanamine Kitchen's act was canceled? And Reset's not with us this evening either. Is there anything to that rumor about mass food poisoning at Takura Productions? Oh, 
yes. Well, I'm sure that Rosette and your girls are watching and cheering for you wherever they are. All right, it's time to see you dance. Nanako-san, this is it. Are you okay? You're not nervous or anything? Uh, nope. <laughs> Don't worry. There are tons of people in the audience, but they're all here to see us. We had lots of practice, so if you dance your best, I'm sure they'll love it. Okay, all eyes in the stadium are on you. Hey, DJ, play that music! Showtime. I'll be sure to make the most of this opportunity. It's starting. Come on, let's dance.
I know we're all sad Conamine Kitchen couldn't be here tonight, but since it gave us a chance to see this kid's amazing moves, I'd say it's a fair trade. What do you folks think? Will Conamine switch over to Kana Coco before the public gets bored of Conamine Kitchen? Huh? Whoa, lighten up there. It was just a joke. With all these Conamine fans here today at LMP, I better watch what I say. Don't want to end up with a knife in my back when I leave, right? <laughs> Still in all, I'm glad that at least you didn't get food poisoning, Kanamine. If you'd gotten sick, then Nanachan would have been the only one left to perform. No, these people don't care. We've still got the debut of Kanamine's brand new song coming up at the end of the festival, folks. And I know you're all looking forward to that. From all I've heard, it's a scorcher. They don't care who it is. It doesn't matter if it's Kanamine Kitchen or me. Or even Yuko-san. I have no bonds. That's why Yuko-san... The pressure from everyone is crushing me. No one really knows me. I don't have any bonds with anyone. I don't like to sing. I have no right to sing that song. It hurts so much. I feel like I'm suffocating. I want to disappear. Who... Who's there? I'm too weak even to stand. I know I what I want. My heart is it's my heart. I'm afraid 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 Well, that was weird. <laughs> uh, we seem to have gone off script, folks. It's gotten into me. Huh? That was weird. Who was that voice? How do I know about Yuko-san? I never met Yuko-san. There's no way I would... So how? Jima-san, hello? Mashta, where are you right now? Huh? The... the LMB Stadium. I'm sorry, but there's something I need to check with you on. Do you have some time? Yes. I talked to the patients who recovered from that mass lethargy syndrome. It seems the rumor was true. <gasps> you mean... about the curse? No, not that one. Though, I can't entirely deny that part anymore either. Huh? What do you mean? All of their testimonies are consistent, even when I spoke to them individually. When I was watching the video on the site, these ribbon things suddenly appeared and pulled me in. I was in a dark place with tons of people, and I remember dancing to this eerie-sounding song. Someone came in, and I thought that I shouldn't be there anymore. That's when I woke up at the hospital. They all said something like that. So what I saw, it really was... It matches your testimony. I thought this might be some kind of mass hypnosis, and I had a specialist look into the video. But not even the experts can find anything unusual about it. No. One other thing. All the patients I interviewed told me something strange. It was about the silhouette on that video they saw at midnight.
the... the silhouette? They all said that silhouette looked to them like Konami Mashta. That's impossible! Dojima-san, what are you saying? I was surprised at first, too. But there was no inconsistency in their stories, and I'm sorry. But I looked into your relationship with Yuko Asada. Yuko-san? But, but I didn't have one! I mean, we were both with Takara Production, so I know her name, but... But still, I made my debut years after Yuko-san passed on. I read the case file. Huh? I asked that contact of mine for it. According to the file, there was an audition for new talents going on that day. My hunch was right. The witness Takara Productions brought out, who supposedly found the body, was a fake. A, a fake? They were a decoy for the media, since the one who really found the body was a minor. A uh, minor? It was a girl, ten years old at the time, who'd come to audition. Her name was Konami Mashta. No, that's not true. I mean, I never even met you, Gosan. You have to remember, Mashta. When you went to audition that day, you just happened to come across Osada, the idol you looked up to, and followed her. And so you witnessed Osada's death, making you the first one on the scene. Like I keep saying, that's impossible. I don't know, Yuko-san. No, I have no doubt that Yuko Asada was your reason for auditioning. It was mentioned in the application submitted to Takara Productions. It said that back then you felt isolated, and you drew the strength to go on from Yuko Asada's songs. That can't be. I'm sorry, but it's true. You even agreed to police questioning the next day. But seeing Osada dead up close must have been too much of a strain. You went into shock during the questioning and had to be taken to the hospital. Please? The hospital? That's a lie! I mean, I don't remember! Yeah, you don't remember anything. The shock of that incident sealed all those memories away inside of you. Huh? That's impossible! Where's the proof? I never once met Yuko-san! I just need to know one last thing. That diary you always keep close at hand. Whose is it? The diary? It can't be! I found something out, asking around people involved with Takara Productions. Though everyone remembered seeing Osada with it frequently, there was one thing no one could find in her belongings. Osada was never quick to make friends with the people around her. I think that's why the police seem to have overlooked this one thing during their investigation. No. No, you're wrong! That's my diary! It's not Yuko-san's! I just need an answer, Mashta. Nothing is going to happen to you because of what happened back then. I'm just now arriving at the stadium. I'll be right there, so stay put. It's just impossible. Come on, Dojima-san. This has to be some kind of misunderstanding. <laughs> What's going on? My diary. This isn't Yuko-san's. It's mine. We're pushing four minutes here. Old perverts weren't our promoter. Huh? Huh? <laughs> that is so weird. I totally can't remember. <laughs> but like, this is my diary. <laughs> There's no way I wouldn't know the code to the lock. This is stupid. I'll get it soon. Huh? Mizo Chimizu is always scolding me for things like this. That's why I write in it every day. You're right, <gasps> it's 1324, but how did you know, Konami-chan? I heard that Mizo Chimizu decided on that passcode privately with a girl she used to marry. No. 
It's not... This isn't mine. I thought this diary was... Damn it. What the hell? 